Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. I haven't done one of these videos in a very long time, and I was actually requested this video now that we are potty trained, but I wanted to share with you what is in my everyday diaper bag, mom bag, whatever you wanna call it, and how I organize it. But the bag I'm gonna be talk to, talking to you about today is the Mama Martina bag. This, uh, this is the Alex bag, sorry, from Mama Martina, and I have been carrying this for probably about 15 or 16 months, and it is my go-to tote style bag. A lot of times I like to have a backpack, but if I want a tote style bag, this is it. This is made with a really nice canvas on the outside and some vegan leather here on, um, uh, on the straps and the bottom, and it's so nice. Now, again, I've been using this so regularly for over a year now, so it has lost a little bit of its structure. It used to be pretty stiff, but it softened up a lot, but still holds its own very well. Uh, on the front, there is this pocket, and this is kind of a catch-all pocket in the front where I have my phone. This is just an iPhone 6 and my hand sanitizing spray. This is my favorite, by the way, from this Everyone brand. There's, it's a coconut lemon scent. This smells so good. And a bunch of random stuff. Here, I'm gonna pull out, I've got a pen. My lip balm, this is my favorite lip balm. Also, this is from Eco Lips. This is their Mongo Kiss. And this is the vanilla one, I'm sh I, I think. Yeah, I like all of them, but this is just the one that I happen to have. I have another pen. <laughs> of course, I have a Green Lantern. <laughs> and this is a fidget cube I got at the homeschool conference last year. And if you don't have one of these, I know th there was a while where these were going around Facebook and um, like ads and stuff. It is everything it's cracked up to be. I enjoy this. I use this at church a lot. So yeah, <laughs> kind of random. Uh, this is a headband. Like I said, it's a catch-all pocket and two more pens. There is a main pocket here and we will get to that in a second. But I just wanted to show you the sides of the bag too. It comes with these stroller straps, which I can't remember the last time I used a stroller um, and attached a diaper bag to it, but I just keep these attached. Also has a messenger strap. On the back, it's just clean. One thing I love about this Mama Martina bag is that this canvas still, I mean, there's a couple of spots on it, but it has stayed really clean. I don't know how if it's coming through on the camera, but it's still very white. It is not discolored like I've seen other navy and white bags like this discolor, and this has not at all. And then there's the other side. So there's no uh, bottle pockets or anything. So let me just open, give you a view here. And um, I have a bag or organizer in here, so I'm gonna pull that out so I can show you the bag organizer and also show you the internal pockets and how I have that packed. So I'm gonna set it up here and grab the bag insert, and we'll get to that in a second. And here is the inside of the bag. There's a zipper pocket here and two elastic pockets. And on the other side, there's just two elastic pockets here. In the big zipper pocket, all I have is an extra pair of underwear. Brayden has been potty trained for just a month or so now, and, um, so, and we have had zero pee accidents. In the house, outside of the house, perfect. So I have just a pair of underwear for him, and I have other changes of clothes inside the car. I don't need to carry everything with me all the time. So that's what was in that zipper pocket. In this elastic pocket, apparently I have nothing. And this elastic pocket, I have a, uh, an Ipsy bag. And in here, I have just kind of random mommy things, I guess. I have some tissues, a comb. That's not for me, obviously. I have my healer tin from Perfectly Posh. Some spry mints. If you've never tried these, they're really good a nail file matchbook, a little mirror, a packet of Plexus Slim. I don't take that anymore, it's just an extra one. Uh, some floss, and a tiny pocket knife. So that fits all the way in there. 
I don't get Ipsy bag anymore. I just wasn't using it, uh, using the stuff from it as much. It was fun and these bags are so great and they're such a perfect size for your purse. And uh, yeah, so I found a lot of uses for these Ipsy bags. And in the very bottom, you could see, you've seen this probably in all of my diaper bag videos, but this is my Planet Wise wet bag for my extra mama cloth, because you never know. Um, but I have a mama cloth pad in there from Pink Lemonade Shop. And in the other, and this is a wet dry bag, so you can carry like your, your dry one in here and your wet one in there, but I just like to have two sizes with me. And in the smaller pocket I have, sorry, I have a panty liner. I'm doing some more mama cloth videos coming up soon, so just stay tuned for those. We're gonna flip this bag over a little bit and show you what I've got in here. In this elastic pocket, I think all I've got is my wallet. Isn't this wallet beautiful? It was like four or five dollars, maybe six dollars, I don't remember, at um, Walmart, and it's just so pretty. And in this pocket, I have a lot of random stuff. I have some peanut butter crackers, a tape measure. This is so great. Everybody needs to have a tape measure in their purse. It's It comes in so handy. This is a uh, portable charging block. I have a little keychain, sorry, keychain flashlight here. And a thumb drive, because again, you never know. <laughs> And, and last of all, I have this Norwex um, Relaxation Rescue Gel. If you've never tried this, this is amazing stuff. It's kind of like an icy hot, no, it's more like icy, kind of like biofreeze, I guess you could say. And this is my go-to for Caleb and his growing pains. It works so well on his little knees when they hurt. And I love to roll this on my neck when I have a headache. So this is one of those never leave home without it <laughs> kind of products. Oh, and one more thing that I missed. This is a reusable grocery bag. A friend gave me this and I love it because it ties up into this little thing so I don't have just this giant bag kind of flopping around in my big bag. And it's got a, a little uh, toggle on here, if that's what that's called. And uh, you just open it up and it's a grocery bag. And I like a, if I'm stopping in a store for like one or two things, I'll bring this out because it's just convenient. So let me show you the bag insert that I have. Okay, this is my bag insert, and I actually got this from the Wish app. If you have ever heard of that, it's one of those apps from that has all the China products that are super, super cheap. And I wasn't sure about the app, but I thought, well, I'll try a couple things from it. And I'm gonna be doing a Wish app review later on, so stay tuned for that. But this is something that I got, I think it was five or six dollars with shipping included. And it's been working great in my big diaper bag. And I have no idea why it took me this long to get one of these. I don't know, it's it's amazing. But as you can see, it's just it's just a bag you can, like with organizing pockets, you can lift out of your bag, put in your bag if you need um, storage for more things. But there's some, I don't use every pocket in here, but there's some mesh pockets here, and some slip pockets here. In this one, I have some tissues, and these are actually, behind the spry mitts, these are my favorite, the Breath Savers, sorry, Breath Savers Protect. They're really good. I can't find them everywhere. Oh my goodness, there's only one left. That's sad, but they're these little wafers and they don't use artificial sweeteners. I think it's, yeah, xylitol. It's sweetened with xylitol and it's so, so good. Cause the ones with, ooh, the ones with sucralose or Splenda give me headaches. That's not good. I have two granola bars and flip it over to the other side. There's the same type of storage over here, okay? On the sides there are these zippers. So this, as you can see, can hold a lot. This zipper compartment here has just this bag and this is one of these bumpkins bags and I have all of my gift cards. And it looks like I have a bunch of, and I guess I do have a bunch of gift cards. I think there's some store loyalty cards in here too. Um, but I'm one of those people, I save gift cards until every single cent is spent. Like I'll have a dollar fifty on a card and I will save it. So that's why I have so many. But I think that's all that is in there. Um, oh, there was something in this other side. Sorry about that. So oh, there's a good something in here. Best dark chocolate, you guys. Besides Dove, this is dark chocolate from Aldi. Oh, 
it is almost exactly like Dove. I love this stuff. And I don't know why it's in here. I don't remember putting it in here. I remember throwing it in my purse. Maybe it just kind of fell into this big pocket. Um, but I always have dark chocolate in my purse. Because why not? And I have another granola bar and some pistachios. In the big section, there are these two little handles right here. So you can just take it in and out. And I'll just start with over here on the side. Whoa, okay, it's gonna fall over. So we'll just let that happen. This is another purchase from Wish and this is an essential oil travel case. And um, I'm not sure if this is gonna be like a permanent solution to something I keep in my purse because it does add some weight. But, um, so we're just trying it. But in here I have roller bottles that I've made. I don't travel with the full essential oil bottle because I dilute everything if I'm gonna apply it topically. So in here, I can't remember exactly everything that I have. Oh, this is my peppermint. This is my digest zen, digi zen. I don't remember. This is a sniffles and sneezes mixture I made here. This is Plant Therapy's Worry-Free Synergy. These are some pretty tight elastics, but they're perfect. This will fit the 15 mil bottles and also the 10 mil bottles and five mil bottles and the 10 mil roller bottles. This is Plant Therapy's Worry-Free Syn Synergy. This is Young Living's Deep Relief. And this is a pain blend that I made up or that I made up, that I mixed up. <laughs> and here I have, sorry, some inhalers. And uh, I'm about to switch these out because they're getting weak. And then this isn't essential oil, but it is my little thing of Tylenol. <laughs> so that's that. This is a pretty, I mean, it's a pretty hard case. <clears throat> and then all that's left are my planners and one more thing. This right here I have mentioned before. Or I believe you're gonna have to double check me, but these are some bamboo, what do you call them? Not silverware, utensils, bamboo utensils. There's a spoon, fork, knife, chopsticks, and I stuck one of my glass straws in there. This came in a Mighty Fix a couple of months ago. And then I have my planners. I don't always have all three of them in here, but I do always have my A6 Hobonichi. This is my brain. Uh, I, I don't want to think about what would happen if something happened to this, but this is where I keep all of my daily plans, weekly, monthly, everything is in here and it's such a great size to go in this bag. And this is my fitness and health planner from Recollections. I did a video about this. I can uh, link it up there in the cards for you, but uh, I don't take this everywhere I go. If I'm eating out or if I am uh, going to work out at refit, I will take this with me so I can write that down. So there you go. And this is my YouTube planner. I'm gonna do a video on this. On, this is a Hobonichi Weeks, by the way. And I use this for YouTube and I'm gonna do a video on how I utilize, utilize this for YouTube. So I hope you enjoyed this video today. I, I really enjoyed doing another what's in my diaper bag or what's in my mommy bag or whatever you wanna call it. Uh, I haven't done one in so long and it's kind of funny as when your kids are like really like babies, you take all this stuff with you. And then um, when they get a little bit older, there's like a stage where you just don't need that much. And now when they get older, I mean, I shove activities in there sometimes. You know, it, it just kind of depends on where we're going, what we're doing. Now the boys have their own little backpacks that we take with them to church or someplace where we know they're gonna have to sit for a while and have to entertain themselves. And so that's kind of taken some of the weight off of my bag. But I've gotten to where I just like to carry a bunch of stuff because I everything you see in there, I use and need. So, I mean, it's not minimalist and it's not excessive, it's somewhere in the middle. But do you have a mommy bag? What is it? What is your favorite one? What are some of your essentials? Leave that down in the comment section. I would love to hear from you. If you enjoyed this video today, please be sure to give me a thumbs up and of course subscribe if you are new here. I hope you're having a great day and I'll see you next time. Bye.